Hi Scorpio, it's L here to do your weekly reading. This will run from September 22nd through the 28th, 2019. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, subscribing, commenting on the uh, video. Um, go ahead and click that like button. It does help the channel. Let's go ahead and get started. So we have the situation advice outcome. We've got two cards for the advice. It's how it fell out. So the situation is a five of air. All right, so maybe something's coming back up from the past. You tried to get over it, separate yourself from it, heal from it. Now it has cropped back up from the past. This is interference, maybe from other parties. This is uh, definitely an affair uh where there are more more than two parties involved it could be third party i don't know um this could be this is someone wanting to win at all costs this is someone also feeling like there is lost cause here or failure here uh or there will be failure this is someone childish games childish behavior could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Doesn't have to be, but this is what's around you. This is rumor circulating. Uh, this is either you in, involved in gossip or someone around you is gossiping about you or you, they. Okay. The advice here in this situation is the page of air and the seven of water. Uh, the advice here is to be frank, to be honest, to be straightforward, blunt maybe even without tact or yeah um you know it's not a well thought out speech in regards to you may be just cutting something off speaking once about a situation um also be be eager to get in front of Be eager to get in front of a situation that may spiral out of control, that has an element of illusion or disillusionment. You may have to make a really tough decision, choice uh, here. Uh, that's the only way you get in control of it. The sevens talk about control, getting in control of a particular relationship, business partnership, contract, something of that nature, uh, marriage. Um, there may be cir something circulating, something that you, you thought you dealt with has now come back and you have to kind of cut it down at, at, at to the root, and to the root of, get to the root of the situation. That is the advice. The outcome here is uh, the king of fire. So it may be involving um, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Uh, a committed man, maybe someone you are or were married to. This could sometimes be Gemini also. Um, this would be a Gemini male. Um, this could be a Cancer male. Hmm. This is someone after their own desire, their, their heart's desire. So they really have not taken into account anyone or anything else. So the outcome here is maybe put yourself first, propel yourself in regards to dealing with this situation. Um, what's the fun? Yeah, ask your angels in regards to how to deal with this particular person or persons. There may be some interference in regards to you trying to resolve or dissolve marriage. There was infidelity here or there is infidelity there's someone trying to prove that or disprove that there's someone who is staying blindfolded in regards to making a decision knowing that a choice needs to be made that a decision needs to be made there needs to be a cutting away of you can't continue to allow a certain energy around you and your atmosphere and your environment yet get more information it says the page of swords while cutting out um, compromise definitely could be talking about maybe a Sagittarius male 
there's a need to compromise in regards to uh, someone someone says things just to say them they don't mean it they don't they don't mean it they don't mean, like they don't they're not going to follow through at all i'm getting antsy now there's someone who is completely um tired of tired of dealing with someone who doesn't who doesn't mean well they they say things just to pacify the situation at that time but they don't they have no intention on doing or fulfilling or following through yeah they may be asking for forgiveness this person made a lot of promises either to you scorpio or you vice versa and they meant none of them they didn't they weren't going to ever fulfill them you may need to forgive this person scorpio they know not what they do they know not what it is that they missed or an opportunity that they've missed out on. What's the best course of advice for Scorpio in regards to dealing with this situation as we close out this reading? Thank you, thank you, thank you, Lord God. One more. All right. I'm hearing, like, somebody's just frustrated because somebody sends somebody in a roundabout because they want to believe what they have to say, but then none of it ever manifests, none of it ever comes true volunteer okay so you may need to volunteer information seeking and finding yeah you may be trying to get more information you may want someone to volunteer you need to volunteer the information that maybe someone's looking for uh, someone wants to know they just want to know your business. This is just a nosy individual just to know. They just want to know to know. Yeah, emotions. Deal with your yeah. seven of water. You're very confused. This is a very emotional just, uh, choice you have to make in regards to religion and spirituality. That'll help you get through. That'll help you to forgive and to compromise. Uh, keep the faith in regards to dealing with some very challenging energy. I hope the best for you this week, Scorpio. Take care. If you feel like this reading, excuse me, resonated with you, go over to the website. Book your own reading just like this one. Uh, the link is below. Um, situation, advice, and outcome uh, is $9.99. It comes to you via email. Take advantage of that. Or if you need something more in-depth, Go over to the website, look around, get a phone reading, get a, a video recorded reading. Um, yeah, take, take advantage of that, all right? Thank you, Scorpio. Take care, guys.